Hi there. Most mornings I start my day right here in my living room with a workout. I work out with those people. And you know what? You know who I think about? I think about you. And I wanna tell you why, and that starts with a story. When I was 21 years old, I found out that I was born with a different kind of heart. I found out that my aortic valve, the big valve, instead of having three flaps like it should, only had two. And that changed my life in many ways. In my 30s, I had that valve replaced. I had open heart surgery. And since then, I've had a titanium valve clicking away in my chest every day. It's changed my life in many ways. And one of the ways it has affected me is with my workouts, with my interest, with my goal of getting in shape. I've had to recognize that I'm different from other people, which has been a struggle for me, and it still is a struggle. And I've had to recognize that I have a different rhythm when it comes to getting in shape. And you know what? It's not like the rhythm of the people on the screen I just showed you, who I watch every day. It's natural for me, I know, to compare myself to those people, which I do all the time. But I've had to accept that my rhythm is different. And while I will get to the same goal as them, it's gonna look different for me. My journey is gonna take a different amount of time also. And what I can do every day is different than, from, than what they can do. So how does that relate to you? Well, learning is the same way. Learning, just like working out, has different rhythms. And every one of us in this class has a different learning rhythm. Some of you will get to our end goal at the end of each module and at the end of our course more quickly. Others are gonna need to take more time. What's important to all of you, regardless of what your rhythm looks like, is that you continue to push yourself outside of your comfort zone every single week in this class. And that's one of the reasons why I have such a variety of assignments for you to engage with, because everybody has different strengths. So keep that in mind and know that when you're doing something that doesn't maybe feel quite wonderful, that might not be a bad thing because that's you pushing yourself outside your comfort zone. Have grace with yourself. I know that you will continue to compare yourself to others. Um, just like I do with my workouts, but we are all in this together and together we can achieve the same goals. So I hope that is a little golden nugget that you can put in your pocket and think about not only in this course, but in all of your other courses and in life in general.